giving you a useful tip today for your thoracic spine. And so your thoracic spine is pretty much, if you think about the base of your rib cage uh, up to just before your neck, we call that your T-spine for short. Uh, and within that thoracic spine, there's 12 vertebrae, okay? Um, and then let's talk about why, why are we addressing this issue or what we usually see with this. Uh, the environment that you spend your day in, the most of your time in, is really having a toll on your positions and in your shapes. And, and then also it's making us hard to be in good postured positions, especially when it comes to things like exercise, or trying to create power in the shoulders and things like that. So, you know, if I've spent the most of my day uh, at the desk, I uh, eventually kind of creep into this position and I'm typing, uh, shoulders are forward, necks forward, I'm driving in the car, I'm texting and all of a sudden I'm noticing that I'm spending the majority of my day in this forward rounded position. Now, <clears throat> what I can give you today is a really simple fix and this is something that I think everybody should be doing, especially if you work in a technology style job, which the majority of people are today. Um, this tool right here, a double ball or what we call a peanut, uh, you can make this with two lacrosse balls. I have the mobility wad version called the Gemini, which is nice and fancy. Uh, for $35, this is probably one of the best investments you can make towards your body and towards your fitness, okay? Uh, so what I want to do is just walk you through some basic points of how to use this. And then remember that this isn't going to cure your bad posture and bad positions. The only thing that this tool and this exercise is going to do is give you the space in the room to get good posture. And then it's up to you, a conscious daily decision to when you start to do this in your day, that you tell yourself, hey, back to this position, shoulders back, and being in a good posture position while you're working, okay? Yes, is it going to be challenging and difficult at first? 100%, you've already created bad habits sitting at your desk and being in these shapes. Now we have to undo all those, but this, will be the start to getting you back to that better posture position, okay? So what you'll do is you'll take this ball and you're gonna place it uh, just towards the top of your shoulder blades and it's gonna sit on each side of your spine, okay? And then from there, the easiest thing to do is to give yourself a good old hug. And when you give yourself a hug, it opens those shoulder blades up and then we go on a 448 method. So what I mean by that is uh, you're gonna bridge your hips up and put some pressure into the system you're gonna take a four second inhale, and then you're gonna hold for four seconds while you're holding your breath. You can move around, chin towards chest, side to side, and then you're gonna exhale for eight. And see if you can get yourself to a relaxed state. Now, understand the exhale is the most important piece that's you communicating with your brain and telling it to relax, chill out. You shouldn't be carrying that much tension in between those shoulder blades. So let's do a couple more reps. Bridge up. Exhale. And then even in between, feel free to freestyle. Move your arms overhead. You can do a snow angel and back up, and then eventually if you need to, move. You have 12 vertebrae in that thoracic spine, let's try to touch them all a little bit, okay? So once you find a new spot, bridge the hips up, give yourself a hug, take a breath. And work on restoring those positions that you feel super stiff in, okay? And like I said, you got 12 vertebrae. Uh, if you spent a minute at each, that'd take you 12 minutes. And what you will notice is that some spots don't require that much attention. You'll find that, hey, it doesn't feel that bad and I can move on. And then you're gonna find some other spots where you're gonna have to spend a little more time at. And, and what you'll start learning is about your spine and your thoracic spine and where those stiff areas are at. And then use this simple tool and this simple exercise to help give you the space that you need to sit up in a tall postured position. So give this a shot, grab yourself a double ball and a peanut and go to town on your upper back.